Ten twelve central, I need a squad car to pick come pick up a perp. Ten four cars on its way. Oh look, there it is. Hello everyone, Victory Gaming Dragon here, and today we're gonna play Beat Cop. Start a new game here. When we were kids, we spent countless hours on on watching 80s TV cop shows. We love watching good guys kicking bad guys' asses, saving beautiful women, and driving muscle cars into the night. We knew they weren't true, but we didn't care. We had damn good time, and that's what counted. Beat Cop is not a document about New York in the 80s. It's our tribute to all those evenings spent in front of the TV. So relax, enjoy the game, and don't take life too seriously. All units respond. 1031. Burglary at Yours left point of view. The New York's truth. Workers of the world. You can't really read that. Thunder's diamonds go missing. So I guess that's what the uh, the order where it got away. Unofficial sources report that following a decision by the NYDP chief, Detective Jack Kelly will be removed from his position, and transferred to another division. NYDP Detective Jack Kelly, who shot a burglar at the senator's villa last Friday, is implicated in the disappearance of precious diamonds from a safe in the Senator's villa on that fateful night. I'm sure you've already met our new colleague, but maybe you should introduce yourself again, Kelly. I'm Kelly. Jack Kelly. Hey, Kelly. Sup? Hey, Kelly. Welcome to the street. Detective. Oh, don't forget to kiss our asses, Kelly. <laughs> what are you laughing at, Shapansky? Nothing, boss. Use those two brain cells of yours to write this down. Don't come back without writing ten tickets. You mean ten total? Ten each. You a moron, McNabb? We can do it, boss. Brown nose. That doesn't apply to you yet, Kelly. Why, Sergeant Holloway? What's wrong with me? I don't care about your past, detective. Or if you whack that poor bastard. Or if you swipe the center's valuables. That's what internal affairs is for. They'll take care of you. But now on this street, you're a rookie. I don't know you well enough to dislike you yet. So you don't have to worry about tickets today. Don't even take your ticket book. Don't get any ideas. Don't fuck this up. The detective has it easy with the boss. Better write that down that you need to do what you need to do. Because I won't repeat myself. You need to meet the big faces on your beat. Go see Rick at his cafe. Meet Louie at his pizzeria. Ivan from the liquor store also wants to meet you. Say hi to Adamski for me. Visit her crank. Oh, and the electronics store too. Because they're bitching about our lack of interest. And don't forget the church. You need to meet Father Mushroom too. Oh, and laundry right beside church. You got that? Good. F feel free to meet anyone else there too, since that'll be your beat. But I don't need to tell you that, right? 
your predecessor will show you around. Fat Mike knows the neighborhood like the back of his hand. He'll explain everything. Your call sign is 421. 421, got it, boss. But only Kelly gets a free pass. You definitely need to drop by the church. <laughs> to pray for the boss's favor. It, it sure as shit won't last. Enough bullshit. Get to work. Beat it. Okay. <laughs> Kelly, you're, you've you already been told everything at the briefing. Visit everyone and introduce yourself. Sure. Besides, Fat Mike will tell you what's what. Around here, you're no big shot suit no more. We'll see about that. Your hands were too sticky at the senator's house. <laughs> Assholes. Jesus. You're Polly? Kelly. Jack Kelly. Whatever. Call me Mike, Fat Mike. Or whatever you want. I don't give a fuck. The boss told me to babysit you today. I want to get this over with. Same here. It's my last day on the street. Let's go. Where? Well, grab something to eat at Louie's. It's not fair. Far. We'll check in on Adamski on the way. I had to step in at his place yesterday. We'll see if everything's all right. Notebook update. 421 in the area. On duty. Or 421, remember that. Say hi to me, Fat Mike, for me. Not like he gives a fuck. Hey, hey, you said it. Have a good day, 421. Okay. Do I just point and click? Okay. So... How do I... Check my notepad. Okay, here we go. Follow Mike to a... Okay. So the first thing we need to do is go over here. And, oh, there's the door. This is 421, what's going on? Mike's waiting for you at Adamski's. Where? Adamski's, but, yeah, yeah. Got it, hurry up. On my way. Good morning, Mr. Adamski. Quiet today? Of course. The idea with the freezer was perfect. The freezer? I'll tell you later. This is Polly. He'll be working here for now on. <laughs> Kelly, I'm being transferred to another street. Welcome, officer. Stop by every now and then? I definitely will. Visit stores and talk to the owners. They see and know a lot. This is my neighborhood now, after all. And don't stress too much. You don't have to do everything every day. Some days you can go insane with the amount of that's happening. You'll see, everyone's going to want something from you. You decide what you don't give a fuck about. Because you can't do it all. And the sergeant? He won't always know if you do some shit on the side. Not just quotas and tickets. Because you can't retire on those. <laughs> Relax, that's a good advice. So what was the deal with the freezer? Don't ask, Polly. Kelly. You work here for a while, you'll start to get it. Sometimes you gotta think outside the box. Let's drop by Louie's Pizzeria. He's got some really good food. Yeah? Okay. Oh, if you double click, it makes you sprint. Uh, what is this? That's liquor. Got some guy smoking around a bag? <laughs> what is that? Ah, Louis Pizzeria. Oh, a new policeman. Welcome to our humble establishment. I'm Kelly. We know, we know. We Italians know everything about this neighborhood. We came by for a pizza, Louis. They're transferring me and Polly's taking over. I hope her relationship will be fruitful. 
Of course it will. I hope that unfortunate incident with the senator. A simple misunderstanding. Yes, yes, a misunderstanding. That could be cleared up. Maybe with our help? I can handle it. Ah, of course. But we could always be of help. Polly's new here, but he's a quick learner. It's Kelly. And now, how about that pie? I'm starving. 15 minutes later, huh? Great pizza. Okay, let's go. Notebook updated. Louie makes the best pizza pie in the city. I'm gonna miss it. I bet he sure knows what he's doing. In a month, I'll be wearing your uniform. But be careful, Polly. There are no or the, these are no ordinary Italians. I can imagine. You need to be delicate here. And you might live to see retirement. Like me. Hey, Polly, look, Kelly. It's Polly to me. <laughs> Some dirty hippie didn't pay the parking meter. Write him a ticket before he skips out. I didn't bring my ticket book. God damn it. The boss was right. If I weren't here, you'd probably shit your diaper. <laughs> Take mine. Mark the violation on the ticket. Write your badge number and sign it. And put it behind the wiper. I thought I wasn't supposed to write tickets today. Okay, so we have to write a ticket. So click on this. All right. Um, check meter expired. Okay. So now we will write the ticket. Parking violation. And that's everything I believe is in order. Ticket written up. So let's get this clunker out of here. Call for a tow truck on the radio. Give me back my ticket book. The boss gave you other tasks for the day. Okay, so we need to call towing. Central, I need a tow truck at 609. 10 4, tow truck on its way. Tow truck's on its way? That's right. Good work. Yeah, that got here quick. <laughs> that was easy. The driver didn't show. The worst ones run up and cause a scene. You need to learn to pacify them. Any advice? Just be careful what you write on the ticket. You'll get an earful for the unlawful ones. Okay. Now the handcuffs. What about them? You'll use them every day. So you're gonna need to learn how to cuff a perp. Just slap on the cuffs. Down there on your belt. When you're close to him. 4 one this is central. You got a robbery at Hard Ricks. I'm on my way, 10-4. Oh, I need to help that guy. How do I do it? Just drag the cuffs on him? Do I just click the cuffs? 10-12 Central, I need a squad car to pick, come pick up a perp. 10-4 car's on its way. Oh look, there it is. This is Central. Good job stepping in. Now get back to Fat Mike. He's waiting for your for you by the pizzeria. Got it. Yeah, something tells me Fat Mike doesn't do any running. I need to make it back to... F yeah, I know. Shut up. Good work, Polly. boy. My name is Kelly. Same difference. That thief looked like he was from the crew to me. Aside from the darkies, we also got the Italian mob in the area. I wouldn't fuck with either if I were you. I wasn't born yesterday, man. Who knows? 
Just saying, you got two hostile forces in the area. Now we'll split up. Scope out the neighborhood and talk to people. I've got a few things to take care of. I'll see you at the end of, sh of the shift. Remember, you don't need to push yourself to do everything every day. Okay, let's meet up at four in front of Louis. Okay. Wasn't I supposed to like meet everybody in this area? So I don't have anything that I have to do. But I was supposed to go pretty much meet everybody. Oh. What are you doing here, Captain? I wanted to talk to you, Kelly. I'm listening. We should meet up more often. Thank you, Captain. I didn't finish. I know you're framing. I, I know they're framing you. I want to help. With the murder charge? The kid wasn't a saint. There's nothing, there's nothing we can do for him. But this city needs you. Thank you, Captain. I didn't finish. <laughs> you're a good cop, but there's one condition. Those missing diamonds need to be found. There were no diamonds at the Senators. I didn't know what was and what wasn't there. They need to turn up. The Senator's a key player in getting you out of the shit. Without him, we're both done for. That's a little shady, isn't it? You've got 21 days. Then I'm retiring if you can't find them. In three weeks, there'll be nothing more I can do. Now you're giving me deadlines. I wasn't finished. There's one more thing. If my hunch turns out to be right, this case is going to rock the whole city. What are you staring at? I wasn't sure if you were finished, sir. I was, now get to work. <laughs> okay. Interesting. Find the missing jewelry. The captain will take care of the rest. Oh yeah, that sounds easy to do. Okay, so what's this place? I'm supposed to go to like a church. If I go in here. Oh, it's like an apartment. Uh, never mind. And then there's Hard Rick Cafe. Hello, good day, Officer Kelly. Need anything? I love your figure. Uh, I just stopped by to introduce myself. That's good, very good. You have a very dangerous job. But, Mr. Kelly, I have a beautiful leather jacket. Perhaps you're a fan of motorcycles? I don't think red is my color. But thanks anyway. All of my stock is 100% genuine. People plus? I don't know. Is that good? Uh, is this another apartment? Yep. Alright. So... That's the end of my beat. Okay. Can I go up here? No. There's no point. Okay. I guess I need to go back the other way. These are just apartment buildings. Got liquor. I don't think I went in here. Wait. Peep show. Good day, Officer Kelly. I'm new here. Just wanted to introduce myself. Hello. Maybe we'll finally have some order around here. The one before you didn't really care about the job at all much. That much. It'll be different with me. Goodbye. See you later. Yeah, it'll be different. What's this guy doing? Is that on the balcony, like, waving his arms? Arena's Jewelry. Good day, officer. Can I help you with something? Hello? I came to introduce myself. I'm Jack Kelly, new to the area. Ah, yes. Could I interest you in a signet ring? An officer of the law should look sharp. It's definitely a 
It definitely impressed the Italians, but no thanks. Keep an eye on my store, all right? Expensive stuff. It's tempting, right? What are you implying? People talk. Don't believe everything you hear. Goodbye. Goodbye. Okay. Some other apartment. I don't know why. That might be important later. Um, a dam, a dam skis. And what's this place? Car parts. Crank's drugstore. Good morning, Herr Officer. Officer Kelly. You look wonderbar in that uniform. Is there anything I missed? Any pain injuries? No, I just dropped by to introduce myself. I'm new here. Ah, yes, of course. I'll be at your service. Your predecessor bought a lot of medicine. For embarrassing ailments. Hmm? He completely neglected his health. But there was some semblance of order. I'll do my best. Blute and... Huh? Funny letters. What's this black plaque? From the scout. One of my mentors from Zevar. You lost everything? Unfortunately. My father fought in Europe. You two would have taken quite the trip down memory lane. Perhaps. In any case, I always offer the latest medicine. Discretion guaranteed. Uh, okay. This is Central 421. You got a call at a store. Oh, I do, huh? Froggy caught a thief. Froggy? Where's that? I'm new here. Porn store at 613. 10 4 on my way. Okay. Uh. Is this. Okay, 615, 613. Oh, the peep show place. Okay. So, Froggy. There you are. I finally bagged that thief. I was just looking. That what you always say. It's okay, I'll take care of it. What's he gonna steal in a peep show shop? So what do you do, punk? I was just looking. At what? Rubbers? Thief! Relax, Froggy. Choose an option. Press him? Don't fucking piss me off. Turn out your pockets. There you go. I see you got five bucks. Pay for the rubbers and get lost. But the rubber's a buck. Consider the rest damages. Dumb pig. You want me to lock, lock you up with a mendingo? <laughs> fine, fine, I'm paying. But I'll remember this. Hmm, nicely done. I'll spread the good word about you. Glad I could help. Goodbye. So he was stealing condoms? At a peep show. And porn star, I guess. Okay, whatever. These people are low lowlifes. Gotta deal with the low life sometimes. Hey, is that van parked again? But it doesn't have a meter. Hey, this is no parking. <clears throat> Officer, are you new here? Yeah, I just started in this neighborhood. Oh, great. I like talking to policemen. That's nice. I'll become a policeman too. When I grow up. Dad says it's a good job. Really? Yeah, you can always take bribes. <laughs> I think I should have a word with him. He's not afraid of anyone. Okay, nice talking to you. But I'm wasting time. No, you're not. Check your watch. It's like time stops during conversations. Hey, you're right. I'm going. See you later. Later, kid. Oh, it's already 12.30 in the afternoon? It was just 8 o'clock. How fast does time go? It goes by 5. What are these? Police on the hunt for more African Americans dead? Yeah, okay. More robbers killed by NYDP. What a town. Well, I'm not really sure... If there's... Oh, this guy. I'm supposed to talk to him? Officer, yes. You're new here. We could help you get acclimated. How's that? We can meet up, play a hand. This isn't Vegas. Gambling is illegal. 
we said, who said anything about gambling? A little R and R never hurt anybody. Nobody. Hmm. I'll think about it. Please do. Thanks. I have to go. Later. Those birds are flying around there shitting everywhere. Is that what those little white spots are? 421, get to the phone booth now. Sergeant Holloway wants to talk to you. What does he want? I don't know, but I suggest you hurry. They can't demote you any lower, so he'll just fire you. Alright, I'm gone. 10 4. So I have to go to the phone booth. Why wouldn't he just talk to me on the radio? This is Kelly. What do you want, Holloway? That's Sergeant Holloway to you, motherfucker. <laughs> I swear on all that is fucking holy. I'm calling you to let you know. I'm watching you. What can I help you with, Sergeant, sir? Are you fucking with me, Kelly? I wouldn't dare, Sergeant, sir. Your ex-wife, you filthy piece of dog shit? Is giving her daddy hell? Says she's unhappy? And for that, I get shit from the chief. And I'm not gonna get fucked because of you. Pay the alimony, don't fuck around. Or I'll bury you, you Irish fuck. But Sergeant, you don't know the whole... I don't give a fuck. I don't want to hear another word about her. Yes, sir, Sergeant, sir. That's all. Back to work. Yes, sir, Sergeant, sir. How would he even know about that? Anyway. Watch out for bird shit. <laughs> Are you game for a round of poker later at 623? Stamina minus one? What the hell? So, what... What do I do? I don't want my ticket book. Can we just like talk to random people? Oh, how's the weather today, officer? Turn on 96 FM. They're just about to tell you. Did we go in here? Good day, officer. Good day, officer Kelly. Oh, yeah, I did. Good day, Officer Kelly. I'm new cop, the new cop in the neighborhood. Yeah, welcome. We are always welcome for coffee. Yeah, yeah. On the house or something stronger. Thank you. I'll be glad to drop by. All right. So, can I just like buzz somebody randomly? Wait, Mahoney, isn't that a cop? Officer Kelly, just checking in for every day. Everything's all right. With what? The buzzer. That's funny. Or maybe it wasn't a cop. And that's from, uh, Police Academy. McFly. Uh, let's try our Blaine. No answer? What? Sorry, my mistake. Shit, don't make me come down there, you little punk. This is Officer Kelly. Maybe I should come upstairs instead? No, no, no need. Sorry. Have a nice day. R. Babbitt? A. Hall. Who is it? Officer Kelly, just checking in if everything's alright. With what? The buzzer. That's funny. A. Paloon. Or Palane. Whatever it is. W. Anderson. Officer Kelly here. Sorry, my mistake. No problem. Actually, it, it is a problem. I was watching the game. What's the score? The Yankees are ahead. Thanks, and I'm sorry. Have a nice day. Forget about it. Laters. M. McFly. Gee, I wonder who that could be. Marty McFly. <laughs> S. Wartzik. Ripley, is that you? No, it's Officer Kelly. I got the wrong number. Ripley, I need help. They're everywhere. Hicks is down, Vasquez too. And Bishop? They're even impregnated, impregnated him. What are you talking about? Bishop's a synthetic. Right, fuck, it's nonsense. Have a nice day. 
Okay, I'm not sure what that's referencing. E. Brown. Nothing. Okay. Where am I supposed to go? Oh, right here. Good thing I was standing there pretty much right next to it. There you are. Have a look around the neighborhood. I've talked to people. I can handle this police stuff. Sure. What were we waiting for? A friend wanted to meet you. What is he doing? Oh, shit. Shit. Uh, probably gonna get the fuck down. Uh-oh. Jack, I don't think I'm gonna make it. Sorry, I'm so... I'm sorry. For what? It's not that bad, man. You'll be alright. Mike, wake up. Stay with me. Paramedic, put that out and fucking do something. Nothing left to do. Look, his guts are all over the fucking ground. He's bleeding out. God damn. Kelly, watch what you say. The media's here. BS News, can I ask you a few questions? Move back, this is a crime scene. didn't complete the task that gave me the briefing. I didn't meet the key players on my beat. I wrote up my first ticket. The captain will help me with the murder rap. I gotta find the missing diamonds if I didn't take the jewelry someone else did. I need to find out who wanted to get rid of Fat Mike. That shootout was no accident. A gang operates in the area. I already got on their bad side by arresting that shoplifter. I need to have $300 for the island money payment in three days. Got my paycheck, $50. I didn't complete all my duties. My paycheck was Doc 25. Okay, so you gotta have... like You have like little goals to meet, and you get money. So, people on the beat are neutral. And I'm guessing you want to turn people into your friends. Okay, let's go ahead and end the... the first episode of Beat Cop. Hope you've enjoyed. Thanks for watching. If you haven't already, please hit the like button and subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching. Bye.